Tragedy strikes, bachelorette party devastated by explosion in Paris nightclub. The joyous anticipation of a bride-to-be's bachelorette party turned into a nightmare on Saturday, July 6, when an explosion rocked the Pachamama nightclub in Paris, resulting in severe injuries for Theon Price. The incident, which led to the collapse of a section of the club's ceiling, has cast a shadow over what should have been a celebratory occasion, highlighting the unpredictable nature of life and the inherent risks associated with modern urban entertainment venues. Theon Price, who was in Paris to celebrate her upcoming wedding, found herself at the center of a catastrophic event when a scooter battery exploded on the fourth floor of the Pachamama nightclub. This explosion, as reported by Le Parisien and confirmed by the club on Instagram, triggered a chain reaction that caused part of the ceiling to collapse. The extent of Price's injuries was severe, necessitating immediate and extensive medical intervention. According to a GoFundMe page set up by her cousin Monique, Price suffered a fractured skull, another fracture in her ear, and a bleed on the brain, all of which required emergency surgery and a stay in intensive care. Additionally, she underwent facial surgery. The gravity of her injuries underscores the violent nature of the explosion and the subsequent structural failure. The explosion did not just affect Price, three other individuals on the ground floor were also injured due to the collapse of a section of the club's wall. Although these injuries were less severe, they still highlight the widespread impact of the incident. The Paris prosecutor's office noted that the explosion caused a small fire and a blast that led to debris falling onto the dance floor, further emphasizing the dangerous conditions that patrons were subjected to. The community and public response to the incident has been one of solidarity and support. The GoFundMe campaign aims to alleviate the financial burden on Price's family, covering transportation and accommodation costs while they stay in Paris, as well as ensuring that Price's return home is as comfortable as possible. The outpouring of donations and messages of support reflects a communal empathy and a shared desire to see Price recover and proceed with her wedding plans. The incident at Pachamama nightclub raises critical questions about safety regulations and the management of entertainment venues. With the nightclub's manager and owner, Philippe Fashion, confirming that 140 people were present at the time of the explosion, the potential for a more catastrophic outcome was high. The fact that the venue closed shortly after the incident and has since reopened suggests that immediate remedial actions may have been taken, but it also raises concerns about the thoroughness and transparency of safety inspections. The use of a scooter battery in a private area on the fourth floor, which ultimately led to the explosion, also warrants scrutiny. Batteries, especially those used in electric scooters, are known to be volatile under certain conditions. This incident should prompt a re-evaluation of policies regarding what items are permitted within such venues and how they are stored and managed to prevent similar occurrences in the future. The personal toll on Fionn Price and her family is immense. Price, who is from Bryn Mawr in Wales, had been looking forward to marrying her fiancé Chris in just six weeks. The abrupt and violent disruption of her plan serves as a stark reminder of life's fragility. The physical and emotional recovery process will undoubtedly be long and challenging, and the support from her community will be crucial. On a societal level, this incident underscores the need for stringent safety measures in public entertainment venues. The balance between providing an enjoyable experience and ensuring the safety of patrons must be carefully managed. The reopening of Pachamama nightclub so soon after the incident might be seen as a positive sign of resilience but it also necessitates a critical examination of whether all necessary precautions have been implemented to prevent future tragedies. The tragic incident at Pachamama nightclub serves as both a cautionary tale and a call to action. For Fionn Price, her family, and her community, the road to recovery will require immense strength and collective effort. For the broader public and regulatory bodies, this event highlights the urgent need for rigorous safety standards and vigilant enforcement to protect individuals in public spaces. As Price continues her recovery in Paris, with her family by her side, 
The hope remains that she will be able to fulfill her dream of marrying her fiancé. The support from the GoFundMe campaign and the broader community will play a vital role in this journey, demonstrating the power of collective compassion in the face of adversity.